Hey everybody, welcome to my first uh, news episode. So basically what I'm, why I'm doing this is I've got right now about, I don't know, four episodes of my Rogue Tech series um, in the bank right now. So basically they're done and uploaded and they're just ready to be released. And so what I've done in the meantime now is I've installed the newest version of Rogue Tech. I'm still playing on a version that's um, that I can't upgrade. And um, my question is, as I'm wondering, uh, for those of you that have been following the episodes along relatively religiously, if you'd be interested in me continuing the old episodes and continuing moving along or moving to the new version of uh, Rogue Tech by itself, um, or uh, continuing, you know, um, with two series, so having a starting up a new series with the new version of Rogue Tech and then switching back to the old version, um, but that would mean I would have to ro record several episodes of each, um, and then just release them bit by bit as I go along. It might be might become a little daunting. I'm not really sure yet, but um, I'm open for opinion here. I don't mind going back to the old one. I've got everything saved. It's just a matter of uh, reinstalling the older version of Rogue Tech. Um, got it. Certainly easily, easy, easily done. Uh, this new version that I'm playing here is actually, uh, I'm finding a little more difficult. I'm not exactly sure if it's actually more difficult or it's the fact that I'm working with mechs that are, I kind of just started off with. So it's, it just seems more difficult because I'm have to get used to playing without all my good gear again. So, um, but the def definitely this version, um, it's kind of cool because they've got so many new mechs and um, you know all kinds of cool forces in play with this uh, particular version that I really really like. So yeah, let me know. I'm gonna put a poll up and just vote. Um, I'll wait for a little bit before. Like, I think I'll, what I'll do is I'll wait for the next four episodes of my uh, Rogue Tech campaign to get posted, which should be um, by November 20th. I think will be the, the last one that gets posted. Um, so when that one goes up, um, I'll have a look at the poll and see what everyone wants to do. And, um, yeah, I'll just kind of go from there. If I don't get any responses, then I'll just, uh, probably continue along with the old series until, um, the Flashpoint comes out at the end of the month, uh, the new Battletech Flashpoint, uh, DLC. And, um... Good to go. Then I'll make a decision there if I'm going to continue along or what I'm going to do at that point. So yeah, that's the end of this uh, first episode of my uh, Rogue Tech news. And um, if you haven't subscribed, this is the first video you've watched, uh, please feel free to subscribe. I do post every day with uh, Rogue Tech videos, uh, sometimes more than once a day. Um, right now it's kind of random at times of the day that I post because I do have a full-time job working nine to five. So I kind of have to go at the whim of whatever time I've got available to be able to do it. So yeah, but uh, hopefully in the future I'll be uh, doing it uh, at a specific time of the day. But yeah, until then, um, you know, I'll see y'all later.